Hello and welcome to this edition of I Use This App. In today's review, we're going to be going over a free app called Apps Fire. I have it installed for us already, so let's open it up and jump right in. Apps Fire by AppsFire.com is available free to download in the App Store. There's been a huge spike in app discovery apps within the App Store, and Apps Fire is right on board with the rest of them. If you're looking for some paid apps that are gone free, then apps like this will help you find them and make it easy to read about and even download them right from within the app. They made it more community friendly and so you can register with Facebook and share apps with friends and things like that. They also allow some customizations and find apps based off of your interests. iTunes describes the app saying, so what's better than only getting one free app a day? Lots of wonderful free apps every day. With that in mind, let's jump into the features. I'll walk us through some hands-on features here within Apps Fire. So you can see here we start off right at the main screen and we have an app of the day right on the top. It's called Immortalius. So if we wanted to download that, we just simply tap. It loads right up and it brings us right into the App Store. And we can read about it and download it right from there. So we'll go right back into the app. And you can see here it asks us if we want to share it on Facebook or Twitter. We can just hit cancel. Now we can go to staff highlights and we can scroll right through. We can see different apps. So for example, we'll choose camera FX Pro. It was 99 cents and now it's free. We can tap there. And it's rated super by 82. And we can keep going down. It tells you the size, the rating, quick description. And we can even scroll this way and check out the screenshots. So we've got a summary there. And then we even get some feedback from other people that use Apps Fire. And we can just scroll right through there and read there. Once we're done there, we just hit close. And we can scroll through. We've got different categories like productivity, games, photo and video, news. We can click news and check that out. Same thing again. You can see the rating. Scroll through and see the screenshots, and we'll hit close. Now it does do this based off interest that you set right at the beginning of opening the app for the very first time. So once you set your interests, it'll find app deals available for you right within those interests. That basically covers the features, so let's jump into the wrap up. I'm going to give Apps Fire a 6 out of 10 stars. There's so many different app discovery apps in the App Store these days that unless they have a really cool feature that can set them apart, they all pretty much offer the same thing. This app has a clean layout and it's easy to use, but it doesn't really have any kind of special twist. It's worth checking out if you're looking for some paid apps gone free. What did you think about it? Let us know. This concludes this edition of I Use This App. As always, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe on all our videos and we'll see you in the next review.